So, as you guys know, Leafy is here was unbanned on Twitter a few months ago, and of course, he has decided the most lucrative way for him to go is the anti-trans grift. And so he's been posting like several transphobic tweets. I, I say quote unquote transphobic because I don't seriously believe the guy is actually transphobic. Anyway, he ended up starting a feud with Heffles, the queen of all transgender people. And um, he also, he also kind of, he replied to a tweet about me saying that his timeline which was filled with trans people which you know there's a thing about social media algorithms they're catered to your interests so some something's make me believe that maybe maybe leafy's a chaser Th that's entirely possible or it's just the fact that like i don't know what's up with twitter's algorithm recently but it's literally just all trans shit that's it like th th that's it it's, it's just trans people now. Anti-trans, pro-trans, trans people playing Minecraft. Just just wanting to play Minecraft, please. I just want to fucking play Minecraft. And um, yeah, this th this this is me reacting to Keffel's video on um, Leafy. Smash like, subscribe. I do live streams, so if you like live streams, please watch them. When Leafy tweeted, transgenders are fake. And you know, being such a huge- Yeah, it's just him. Him trying to spark attention. Outrage. That's what he does. Very very 2016 troll mindset. Fan of both Calvin and transgenders, I decided to reply to him to show my support. You may have noticed that this video is edited a bit differently than my other videos. To put it simply, due to the ongoing Adderall shortage, I thought adding gameplay might be able to help satiate Leafy's fans because I know they're going to come here to attempt to bully oh, me. God. I'm just trying to blend in. No, I'm liking it. Lines, I'm liking this new change. Okay, it feels very, feels very familiar to me. You know. Unfortunately, attempting to ratio Leafy was a mistake. While I've I was played, away, I I've played this stupid parkour map a billion times. If you pay him money and lick his boots, you can get to the top of the replies. But because I have self-respect, I didn't buy Twitter Blue. This made the ratio yeah, a lot harder to accomplish. For Ratios are meaningless, but it's a fun thing to do on Twitter, despite it not accomplishing anything. I failed to ratio people in the past, and it's never been a big deal. Yeah, couples really fell off. Things were different. People celebrated she this died. like it was some it's sort sad. of monumental win, treating it as something a lot more important than it really is. And my god, did this set off the horde. Due to another change I'm sure advertisers right. love, misgendering Slip and deadnaming are no longer banned on the platform. And after having a flurry Thank of the you, most Elon. annoying people alive in my mentions, Allow racism. I decided it wasn't worth it in deleting Literal Nazis. This only sparked more backlash, however, as well as transphobic vitriol I love the new me, Twitter. Proclaiming that Leafy had epically owned me in the marketplace of ideas because I failed to get enough Reddit updates. Again, I think ratios are meaningless, and mostly just a running joke for me at this point. But a lot of his fans actually seem to think that bigger number equals more right, and took this entire ordeal very seriously. Oh yeah, seriously. that's how the entire commentary see, community I like to have works. Fun online, but bigger number broad, equals right. Annoying trans folks that's literally really how that they fun. work. I've been out as trans for 12 years, and none of this really hurts my feelings. But the sheer volume of the most obnoxious people in existence made using Twitter for what I want to use it for, having fun with my friends, talking about the news and politics, ship posting. That all got a lot harder. I decided to block Leafy and his followers and then move on. Base. Leafy, who is also a very big fan of mine, took this personally and has since been trying to start beef with me. I have no idea why, but he posted the he block He wants screen, attention, that's why. It's literally why. And he demanded an this is what he wants, Keffels. An apology. No. <laughs> Don't make the video. You shouldn't have made the video because he wants the likes. He wants the attention. He wants he wants the relevancy. That's why. That's his whole that's his whole goal. I don't think he's like seriously attacking Keffels or he's like seriously transphobic. But that's the thing about Leafy, is like he's not politically motivated he has no like agenda or goal other than to get attention and make money that's his whole thing and uh it's funny to like shit on him but maybe don't give him attention if you don't if, if you don't want to play into into what he's trying to do but yeah that's my take i don't think he's like seriously against trans people or or anything like that i think he's just fishing for likes and attention but it's just cringe to miss to miss gender keffels like if you think this is a him you must be a <laughs> like <laughs> Loki. For anyone who doesn't know, Drama Alert is run by part-time trans ally DJ Daniel Keemstar. I've had my run-ins with him in the past and tried to give him the benefit of the doubt, but that was a mistake. Shit. 
It's not enough to have an occasionally Keep good take about trans people. Trans you need to totally. stand up for them when people around you are being bigoted. I'm only bringing this up and holding him to the standard because I know he has actually met and talked with trans people before. For wait, wait, no, wait, did I've Keemstar them, meet trans I people? Really I did not Later know that, that day, Leafy decided to do a lot of people insane, into joining bro. by lying that Sneeko was gonna join. Well, I thought that was a lie, but the truth is actually a lot funnier. Turns out that Sneeko was just cucking him. Yeah, I'm gonna call oh, Sneeko God. in like 10 minutes Damn, the tables have turned. He's not responding right now. All right, I'm Am calling Sneeko right now. He better pick up. I'm just gonna call Sneeko again. Why not? Why does he need to go to the gym right now, dude? He was planning. Imagine on, your best dude, friend being Sneeko. Like a call. All right, Sneeko's kind of pissing me off, dude. Her into a. Why is he watching Adam Lanza? I hate that man. guy. It's like Leafy desperately needs Sneeko to let him sit on his lap, call him a good little boy, and give him a crumb of the clout cookie. But seriously though, I can't imagine anything more embarrassing than getting cucked for over an hour by the cuck king himself. Bro, why does Hassan look progressively <laughs> different in every single every single video I see him in? This must be from a while ago like when did he have the sigma beard oh yo i'm like like feeling traumatic thoughts like seeing her with another person it, it's a lot it's a lot to, I, but i think it's something everybody should do bro sneeko should not be talking you know what? You know what? after what you happened with moist smack critical smack like at all before. like mad, no mad, go mad, away mad, dude how how does he actually have fans and viewers after that shit? Like, if you're selling the whole, I'm an alpha male, and then you get freaking demolished by an actual alpha male, how does anyone follow you or take you remotely seriously? That's what I want to know. How is Sneeko still a thing you shouldn't exist? Leafy decided to watch some videos of mine and react to my opinion about him misgendering me on Twitter. Oh, shit. Leafy can be as transphobic towards me as he wants. He will never be a YouTuber. L. L. Leafy L. God him. damn. I That's a good word. I still want an apology. He's trying so hard to lean into Leafy will never be a YouTuber. But as a PhD That's a good one. That's a good I'm not one. buying it. He couldn't Leafy even commit to he her pronouns. It's just kind of sad. And it's not even that L hard plus to be ratio. transphobic. There's like a million first name bunch of number Twitter accounts that are way more committed to this than he is. This. This Why, person Yeah, like Matt Walsh, man. Like, something. get on Matt now Walsh's level, bro. The issue. About, and, uh, yeah, be sure to ask her for... An apology. I don't know. She's having a fucking mental breakdown. Let's see what the hell she even was talking about. She was starting shit with me, and I saw in her like Twitter bio before she blocked me. Honestly, I think he's only acting this way as a grift. Like with Sneeko, he knows yeah, the yeah, hot yeah. topic right is. now and is trying to lean is. into it as a last ditch effort for relevance. But he's just so non. I've interacted with enough of these cringy edgelords. Leafy said that he could definitely fuck work. a hot girl with a dick as long as I don't have to suck her balls or anything totally gay. Don't take them Which seriously. Which recasts all his weird comments about my genitals and doing. That's new how they light. win when you take There's, them seriously. Are you, sh are you guys sure that uh, he cut his dick off? Does Keffels still have a dick? Oh shit! That dude straight up chopped him off one in the chat if you think he's hot if this person wanted their penis back is there any way they could get it back such incredible questions could only come from the same genius that used yahoo to look up google it honestly makes me wonder all the stuff that he no. said about my genitals he used Isn't yahoo to look up google sexual reassignment that's surgery. funny I bet, I, really I bet, I bet that's what most people use Yahoo for, just to like look up the Google. And looking up from their there has to be like gameplay. research on that, like, like what's, the most, what's the most, what's the most search thing on Bing, talk and me. it's probably it Google. Out, they actually don't care about it's whatever like who drama he was using to try and stay relevant. Their ADD had moved on. This has all been pretty funny, but I really do want to highlight that this started over a dumb ratio. I don't think this shit actually a works with the gameplay. From like it actually works. Through all of the jokes, Leafy Although is I'm literally playing a game unhinged. and watching gameplay the at the same time, I'm like from that ADHD just completely dude. Off. Like I get that he's edgy and he's a time capsule of 2015 YouTube. He's not even edgy anymore. Lobbies, it's just even cringe. So a lot of the shit he said is like, genuine. 2016 edge unhinged. is just lame like now. The way that he reacted to me talking about really planning is. to take my own life. Saying I should try oh, harder. Shit. So many people, dude. Oh, you know, I, I tried See? to kill myself. Well, you know, what went wrong? I should have tried harder. Or what he said when See? I talked it's about watching cringe, my father dude. being taken off. That's just support. cringe. I got to dude. be there to witness him suffocate to death. Oh, and God. No. It's still something don't, that, this person's just fake, dude. I'm don't. About. Fake Leave. woman, <laughs> fake fucking dude. Shut they have up, no day. It's up. just fake. And again, up. remember, this is over God, a Twitter it's, ratio. It's,
I know Leafy really isn't cringe. a stranger to seeing extremely unhinged things. I kept asking myself why he reacted this way, why he even decided to stream about me, but I did eventually find out why while editing this video. <laughs> a little over a month ago, Tom Dark put out a video about Leafy's return oh, no. where a huge revelation was dropped by Keemstar. Oh, I'm gonna have to do an intervention with Leafy. Oh yeah, he's oh, broke. Yeah, you're bringing him back again? He spent all his money no, on that. I'm way. actually gonna have to do an intervention oh. with him. Maybe I should make fun of him. Like, Talk to Leafy like intervention. Three, two of those times he's cracked out of his fucking mind. <laughs> you know, hasn't he always been like that though? Like forever. He lost a lot of money. True, in crypto. but it's like bad now because he's like a grown up, grown up. <laughs> like, yeah, it's true. Know. I don't know. You know what I mean, it, I guess, like, Leafy never day like day grew too, up. Like, that's the, you that's could the you could give the excuse like oh like you know he's on the daily YouTube grind like he needs the fucking Adderall to like you know. Make Get him sustain videos. his upload schedule and Dumpy cannot yeah, be talking. Can, like, Dumpy cannot be talking. Does he still use that? Apparently, Leafy's struggling with drug addiction. He's got his license taken away from him. He, for... I did see that. He posted. Wait, 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 wait. That got taken away for. I thought. I thought he got it back after that. Because then we well, got arrested lost, and whatnot. But he, he got arrested. He lost his license for like, uh, like three months. He finally got it back. Uh, tonight he fucking calls me drunk, and he's like. Oh, I'm wasted. I'm like, what are you doing? Like, listen, man, I'm Brady, F Tom Brady. <laughs> like, what's wrong with Tom Brady? He's like, okay. I put a thousand dollars on Tom Brady and he lost the f game. I'm out of a thousand f dollars. I'm like, well, what are you doing right now? You're in your car driving? He's like, yeah, I'm fucking driving. I'm like, well, how drunk are you? He's like, I'm not drunk where I, you know, I, I can't fucking drive. Like, I can see the road. I'm like, oh, okay. Well, Amazing. you're close to home, close to home or whatever. Yeah, I'll get there fast. I'll get there real fast. By the oh, way, I lost God, my no. license for speeding. Oh, yeah, I saw that. <laughs> like, yeah, I got it back, though. He's like, I'll just... What I got to know is that, like, or all I have to do is just, like, follow the speed limit. Wrong. Bro, imagine Given drinking and driving. It makes That's a lot so crazy. more sense why Leafy was completely out of his mind during that stream. At one point, someone linked him Destiny's fan fiction that he wrote about me, and Leafy's response was so funny, dude. Keffels, a case study on internet terrorism and mass oh, media gosh. manipulation. Yeah, the Destiny is a bit years, of a weirdo. Progressives and conservatives have waged a vicious war. Okay. Leafy's too retarded. He's not going to read any of this. Uh, Many hours later. This is a little bit too long. Jesus. Four to six more days later. All forms of transphobia are banned in my chat rooms and Discord. All right, I can't read all of this, but I believe uh, I believe him, and you know this person definitely is an internet uh, terrorist. I got. By the way, for anyone wondering, the beef between Destiny and I has been buried. Neither of us have any interest in continuing it. We even bonded over both of us accidentally doing meth. In all honesty, though, I feel bad for Leafy. I know what it's like to do drugs and say unhinged shit online, and I hope that he gets help. I don't really care that he was transphobic towards me. Okay, I'm sorry. He's not getting help. He's not getting help. Like, it's been how many years at this point? Six years? Like, seven years, dude? Seven years? He's been like this for seven years. He's not, he's not getting help. He's, there's like, he's screwed. There's no hope for him. He's not, he's like, what's he gonna do? Like, he was, he was banned from, yeah, he has nothing to fall back on. It's just this. This is it for him. Just capitalizing on his old, old, old cringe old cringe edginess that's all he got like that's it that's it for him this is like as as far as he can go he, he like there is no progression for leafy he can only regress that's it it's kind of sad because like he can't do anything else he can't be anything else ever because no one's gonna watch him no one's gonna care unless he's doing the whole yo i'm a 2016 boy yes that's me remember remember 2016 guys remember the old days where you could bully disabled kids and that's that's it that's like that's all he is and that's all he'll ever be because on a human level i just want to see this guy get some help it's just sad like imagine your entire legacy is being an internet celebrity only known for being annoying and bullying people online and then you become a terminally online icarus and fly too close to the sun and get permanently banned from all the platforms that you got popular on in the first place and then you slowly deplete your bank account because you've accumulated no skills outside of roasting sad. people and you are so high all the time now that you can't even properly do that after returning that's my only sad. advice to you calvin is that you need to look for some better friends the only person <laughs> yes in the world yes he does he does he needs about he getting needs real friends these issues is keemstar bro leafy is literally me dude your life worse if it's funny enough
We're talking He's about like a literally me if I didn't trans, if I didn't trans out, bro, if I didn't take the Troon juice. If you keep going down this me. path, you'll be absolutely no different from the people that you and other commentary bros mocked for years online, and they will turn oh, on God, you no. in an instant. Oh God, no! Leave me alone, please! I don't want to fight you, bro. I really bro. hope you get some help, dude. This is the last I'm going to be mentioning you. He really fell off, though.